Hey yo guys, welcome back to another FFPE video and today we will take care of the um, Chronic Battle against Sin and we will do two clears, um, one with Aaron and one with Star Player Titus. So let's um, do the um, Aaron clear first and I will do all missions with both teams so this is the team i will go um over the equip really quick um our own chronicle weapons his stmr um clash of woods gear um a source of guts lucid lances um the only um stmr besides his own on him and um yeah tmr buster style um LB damage stuff, he has 300% ferry and 350 LB damage and a um, decent attack card. Uh, we will take Seymour as our magic tank, he, um, he has 100% um, evasion, has draw from the diadem of will and basically uh, immunities and for any kind of um, Difficulties as uh, another source of guts and yeah a little bit of um, SPR. Yeah, that's basically it. Uh, Rico, um, a source of guts, um, obsidian bracer for the preemptive breaks, um, immunity, and that's it. <laughs> and Walker, uh, ten thousand needles um, because we will need to evade one attack. Uh, status immunity and guards from this card so let's go uh, this is a turn five clear i will we can do a turn three kill with our own but i will do a turn uh five clear because if you don't have x3 or x2 um iron um and you only have an x1 you can follow this quote unquote strat for his srb on turn five um so with Seymour we will do his um, cover for the step buff, um, he uh, preemptive covers but we need a little bit of step buff. Um, Riku will do Enthundera for Enthundera and, and Light and light Gur for a Thunder Imbue and Light Imbue and a 25% Imperial. And we will do an Encentric Altana for the Fairy Killer buff. I know. I can use a Spirit Slayer, but if you don't have an EX3 Riku, use Eccentric Altana. So, Waka will do his LB for the um, better defense break and the 120 Imperial. And Auron will do his LB for um, a better um, Wind Imperial, and that's basically it. So, Auron's LB. To do a little bit of chip damage, uh, just in case. So, um, yeah, normal attacks and a little bit of uh, gravity damage, but uh, yeah, we will take those. And now Rico will do chaining, we will do triple BS, and Vaka will also triple BS. And Auron will now do a Guardian's Duty for the 50%. Um, wind Amplify and Limit Burst Damage and Step Buff and 2 times Omnius Storm. So we will press our one first and um, with uh, if if he ends drinking about uh, from his jug on his um, animation, we will press the chain. So let's wait and he is done drinking. So let's chain. And maybe we will get the second hit. I think we got uh, the second hit in this um, chain, but yeah, let's guard with Seymour because this is a um, uncoverable, uh, uh, no, uh, unresistable attack. So um, guard for the better mitigation. So we got uh, SLBs ready, but we will ignore them to uh, do a turn five. Here. So um, yeah, let's think about it. We we will need. 10,000 needles because it will be now a um, AOE two hit attack. We will wait the first and we will gut these uh, guts the second attack. 
Um, Auron can do three times Omnia Storm for a little bit of um, chip damage, but first let's um, let's do um, yeah, Eccentric Arjuna for the Fairy Killer uh, and two times Ultra Potion to heal up Seymour. And Seymour will yeah juice juice use Bar Dark Dark yeah, uh, just for a little bit more of um, yeah mitigations and stuff, and Auron will chip a little bit of damage. So, now, case AOE, we evade the first one and guts the second one. And now we can do a quadruple ability. Let's do um, Drain Tackle to do a little bit more damage. And Auron can Omnia Storm again. And with Riku, we will um, yeah, we will reapply the abuse and heal Seymour a little bit. And Seymour will now um, guard and yeah, chain Aaron and Bakker. So nice. Uh, we got because we uh, he will get another um, Gravija attack. So we will take less damage. And now the SLB for a EX1 Auron should be ready. So triple um, drain tackle and triple tall boy. And yeah, we will press Auron first. Wait if uh, wait um, for him to appear near on the screen. And after this we will chain the chain. So we will wait and do it now. I messed up a little bit, but it should be okay. Yeah, perfect. Sin is at one HP, and yeah, after after this, he withdraws, and we will win. So this is the Auron clear. We did um, all missions with four units or less, five turns or less, and nobody got KO'd. Damage received, yeah, three point. Uh, 3.4 billion. Uh, I didn't crown my Aaron, so yeah. And now we will um, go to the um, Titus team and do it with Titus. So, um, see you later. Oh, just in a second. <laughs> so, now we are at the Titus team, or with the Titus team, and I adjust a little bit, um, a little bit of, um, the gear from um, Rico and Waka, but I will show the gear really quick. Um, yep, yeah, Titus. Um, yep, yeah, I need a little bit of some uh, some STMRs and stuff, but uh, from Yuna and Aaron. But uh, Clash of Worlds gear and um, this kind of stuff. He has. Um, let me really quick uh, look. Um, yeah. Oh, uh, whoops. I will. Adjusted really quick. Um, I give him the Auron card because I um, do need a little bit of uh, gear and such. So he has 300% um, Fairy Killer. That is nice. And yeah, uh, 300 LB damage. Seymour's uh, um, uh, gear didn't change at all, but I need to um, re equip a vision card of him because some for some reason if you load a team they uh, they um, or if you save a team and load them um, they will not um, save the vision cards so um Riku got a little bit of um, equip a little bit of um, yeah fairy killer and um, she has a 275 fairy killer and um, she doesn't really need a card, but I will give her one. So I'll give her where's Link's card? Um, there we go, Link. Perfect. Uh, she has guards from Reno's goggles and yeah, Waka. Uh, yeah, for damage against fairies, but I don't know. He has 225 fairy, and yeah, we need to give him the um, guards card. Sorry if this ones take a little bit, but we are now 
now done. Where, where is he? Level 10. Level 10. Perfect. So, yeah, let's get right into it. And I give them both F spurs for Fairy Killer. Yeah, let's go. So, this should be a turn 4 or a turn 5 clear. Um, yeah, let's see. So, Seema will again pretty much the same actions. Um, do um, cover, Riku will do and Thundra and, and Lightgar and Fairy Killer. Vaka will do his LB and Titus will. Um, let me really quick four turns. Um, yeah, we'll do Ace's ability, Splash Hunt, and Quick Hit for a little bit of chip damage. So, against on Gaze, Gravija, pretty much K. Okay. Sima will now guard. Riku um, will a little bit of chaining. So, three times Tallboy. Three times Drain Tackle and Titus uh, can't do his LB actually, so Titus first and chain both. So big damage, now turn 3, this here we need the 10,000 needles. Riku will um, yeah, re-imply the um, Fairy Killer. Uh, and do double potion to heal up Seymour and Seymour will uh, can do uh, Dark Cry again Dark Yar <laughs> and Titus will do Energy Rain and double Quick Hit 2 do a little bit of chip damage again so Gaze perfect um, yeah we do a little bit of chip damage again. So triple tall boy again. And um, yeah. Drain tackle and quick hit with Titus. Um, it could be possible to kill him right now, but I'm not very sure. So, so let's do a little bit of damage. And Seymour will just guard. Because Normal attacks and uh, gravity damage. Easy. So now we will reload again and use Titus SLB. And yeah, it is a little bit of a slow one. If Titus is in the air, we will chain the chainers. So let's wait. And he's in the air. Perfect. Again. Nobody got KO'd. Um, four more units, uh, four or less units, and um, five turns or less. So, um, yeah, these are the clears. Um, he did 1.6 billion, and Walker did. Walker and, and Riku did a respectable damage. Um, pretty much neat, I would say. But, um, yeah, this is the clear, and. Um, I did my free summon um, at the morning and it was uh, trash <laughs> and um, I used free tickets and uh, actually got the new Titus and uh, <laughs> immediately uh, STM up Morgul Tim and uh, it was a great pull. Um, so yeah, thank you guys for watching and um, yeah, we will see us in the next video. Bye bye.